you eating the rug? Let's not eat the rug. <laughs> Come here. We're not gonna eat the rug. Hey. <laughs> Come here. We're not gonna eat the rug. So, um, we're gonna do an update while Katniss sucks my arm. Hello. Yeah. Why do you gotta do that? <laughs> Good morning, everybody. It is Tuesday the 15th, and it is noon. Um, I woke up two hours ago. I originally woke up at seven because my dog was crying to leave the apartment. So, got up then and went back to sleep um, because I went to bed really late last night. I'm having a really horrible time on my sleep schedule at the moment. I'm going to sleep late and waking up late, and I don't really wanna do that anymore. <laughs> Any tips of how to like switch your sleep schedule around like I want to get up around 9 every day But my body just physically can't take it um, Because I don't go to bed till 3 in the morning and I can't go to bed before then and I need help I read over 50% of the way through Devil's Daughter by Lisa Kleypas and I am Adoring this book. I love this book. <laughs> I love it so much and I just can't I can't wait to finish it today I'm gonna finish today. It it's gonna happen. I have to go put the card took me last night into my mailbox. That needs to happen today. And we're gonna decorate our Christmas tree more. But for now, right now, I'm going to do my stair workout. Right, Candace? Uh, it's really funny when she's in here. She likes to follow me up and down the stairs so she gets a workout in too. So we're gonna do a workout together. Last night I talked to, or yesterday, I talked to Jen from the Book Refuge and she recommended me a historical romance that has disability rep in it. I think I'm gonna read that one soon. I think it's uh, My Darling Duke by Stacey Reed. And I have this in physical copy, like back at my apartment in my college town, but I didn't bring it here with me at my parents' house, so I don't have it physically on me. She said it has disability rep in it, so I am very excited to read that. I might start that one. Wait, no, I'm gonna be starting Chasing Cassandra after this one. But then after that one, I'm probably gonna read My Darling Duke. So we'll see what I'm gonna do today and read today. I have been adoring historical romances. I have just been flying through them. <laughs> um, it's also just the audiobooks are freaking fantastic for them. So I don't know why, but a bunch of the historicals that I brought with me to my parents' house don't actually have audiobooks. So that's a little troublesome for me because I am in a horrible physical reading slump. <laughs> Like, I couldn't even finish, like, the Black Tiger Brotherhood novella. Like, I couldn't. I can't physically read a book at the moment. I'm gonna go do my stair workout. I also have to fix my nails today because I literally did them three days ago, and of course they're already coming off. It's supposed to be a pattern, like, burgundy, white, gold for Christmas time, and it just started coming off because I had to wash the dishes for a very long time yesterday, and the water... Make sure that posh come off. Hmm. Anyway, enough about me babbling. We're gonna get to doing stuff. Okay, I know it hasn't looked like I have moved, but I have, it is like an hour and a half later. I've eaten breakfast, I did my workout. Um, I'm gonna probably do another 30 minute workout because I have more things to clean up and <laughs> the dogs are playing upstairs, um, if you can tell. And she's playing on the bed. So all of them are just having a grand old time. <laughs> anyway, um, I've done a lot. I'm gonna do another round of workout probably later uh, because I like to do it while I'm putting together videos and stuff and I have to edit my ebook haul, which I am very upset about this ebook haul <laughs> because um, this was the day that I had to take Little Miss Katniss, my mom and I had to take her to the vet and you can just hear him playing up there. And so I had to stop my filming and so by the time I got back, the sun was starting to go down so by the end of the video, it is like pitch black outside and you can, it's the horrible lighting. So um, just be aware when you go see that video. I like, I don't want to refilm it because filming Eva calls takes so much out of me. Like it just does. And um, I didn't want to refilm it again. So you're gonna... <laughs> what are you doing? You scared me. You scared me. <laughs> They are freaking nuts. Anyway, I didn't want to refilm it. It's bad quality. I'm very sorry. So, I got a package in the mail and I did not order a book for myself. So, I think this is a present possibly. So, we're going to open it. Let's see. 
What's this? Is? <gasps> I see the book. Oh my gosh, who is this from? Okay, wait. Okay, so I got this book from my wonderful friend Zay over at uh, Witty Reads on Instagram. I totally recommend her for her Instagram. Uh, I want her to start a booktube channel so bad. I don't know if she's going to, but like, I feel like she'd make an amazing booktuber. Um, but I absolutely adore her Instagram page, and we became friends this year, and I'm so grateful for her. And like, I love how much we talk and chat and everything and so um she said merry christmas av i know this is one of your favorite books so i hope you enjoy <gasps> we have the silent waters by britney c cherry this is my first physical copy of a britney c cherry book and it is my favorite in this series and <gasps> thank you so much say oh my gosh if you have not read this book yet what are you doing with your life uh thank you so so much you are so incredibly sweet i actually adore this book and i can't wait to like put it in with all my other books in my collection <gasps> thank you so much this was so so sweet <laughs> i'm gonna go message her right now and tell her thank you that's so nice thank you i gotta put the i always keep the um letters inside the book so we're gonna do that there we go okay um, man, that made me really happy. Okay, so we are going to be doing some things. Um, I think I'll make one card and then I will do some other things. I really want to read The Devil's Daughter or Devil's Daughter, whichever one it is. Oh, do you want to you say hello? Okay, oh, okay, okay. <laughs> See, this is normal Katniss. If you saw her in that video where like I showed you her all drugged up, like this is her normally. Like she's lovey-dovey, wants to be on top of you, kissing everything, looking at everything. This is normal Katniss, right? Oh, oh, okay. Hi y'all, it's gonna be my last clip for the day, but this vlog is going to be combined with tomorrow's vlog because I'm actually posting my November Eva call tomorrow and I just finished editing that and it is 12.30 in the morning. So, I just finished editing that, that will be up whenever this comes out is yesterday <laughs> whatever it's already out by the time you're watching this um that video took me a while to edit and i am honestly kind of embarrassed by it um the the lighting in it is just horrible but again i don't want to refilm it because filming eva calls takes so much out of me because i'm talking for over 45 minutes each of those videos and it just it drains me and I can't do it again and so I can't go refilm it. Mainly I just wanted to let y'all know what ebooks are out there for free, potentially free to go grab. So that was the main reason for that video. So what I did today, um, I mainly read Again the Magic by Lisa Kleypas. I am 70% of the way through I want to say and oh my word I want to finish that tonight but I don't think I will maybe I will I don't know I still have so many cards to make I don't think I'm gonna make one tonight um I think I'm gonna dedicate some time tomorrow I did my stair workout twice today because I had to burn some calories because I made some macaroons macarons my first time making them and they came out pretty good <laughs> so this is what they look like we tried to make them a little green for like the Christmas season. Um, you can maybe tell they're really green. I, I really like them, so we're gonna have one right now. So, they're really good. They're obviously really sugary. <laughs> There's so much sugar in these. I put a lot of filling in there Oop. because. I made too much buttercream and I didn't know what to do with it. <laughs> we still have so much left over. The batch that's in the main house right now, those are the ones that burst. The first ones I put in the oven somehow like burst. These ones didn't and I don't know why because they're in the, they were made in the same batch. Those were just put in the oven separately than these ones. I don't understand. These are just so tedious and hard and long to make and not a lot comes out of them. <laughs> I made about 11 of them and they're really good because they're all like regular macarons are made with almond flour so i can have them so i really like them if you are interested comment down below if you want me to give you the recipe of the um pinterest site i got it off of because i get all of my recipes off of pinterest because pinterest is amazing anyways i'm gonna go take my shower for the night and upload that video and possibly finish again the magic by lisa clampus but my thoughts will not be in this video and any of vlogmas it will be in a separate video 
that I don't know when it's being posted because I'm still waiting on my last book to come in through Libby and is taking a couple weeks. So it may be here in December and it may be here in January. I don't know. <laughs> I won't get my thoughts for a while. Sorry about that. But anyway, um, I will leave you off with tomorrow's clip or tomorrow's section of the vlog. <laughs> gosh my hair looks a mess let me let me fix it <laughs> okay hopefully this looks better <laughs> it's covering up all the wispies um, it is Wednesday at 1 30 I have already done my stair workout I did my nails while doing my stair workout every time I came down the stairs I painted a new nail and then I went upstairs downstairs painted a new nail and then there's like four different coats on here there's the bottom coat then there's the, the color and then I did another layer of color, and then I did a top coat. So I did kind of like candy cane nails. My other Christmas nails that I literally painted on Saturday got all like ripped off on Monday because I had to wash dishes for a very long time and all of the nail polish came off. By the way, if you didn't know, if you have painted nails and they come off really easily, watch how much your hands are in water. I've realized that. Anyway, um, I am almost done with Again the Magic by Lisa Kleypas. I had to stop last night because it's literally like 3.30 in the morning and I needed to go to sleep and um, I was obsessed with it. And our hero just realized something about our heroine and I'm ready for him to go talk to her. <laughs> so I'm super excited to hopefully finish that today. I have to do some cards today. And then I got a package in the mail. Oh my gosh. I literally am reading a message on my phone right now from Jen from the Book Refuge and she literally said my package should have gotten there today and I'm literally just not talking about it. So I think this is from you, Jen. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's two books in here. Oh my word. Okay, so she got me two books. One of them I know is her, one of her favorites literally of all time, so there is no surprise there. Um, but she ended up getting me Lovely War by uh, Julie Berry. I have heard amazing things about this. And she said, this book is fantastic and I hope you enjoy its unique style and breathtaking love story. Merry Christmas, love Jen. I love you, Jen, oh my gosh. I am so excited. Look how stunning this is, y'all. I've been wanting to read this for so long. This book like, smells so good i don't know what is it it literally smells like perfume wrap this up in a bottle and like spray it all over me oh my word oh my gosh okay <laughs> big face thing <laughs> thank you so much Jen. this is so sweet and then she of course sent me like one of her favorites of all time which is mine till midnight and she said cam is so spoon worthy stay away from the audiobook though <laughs> they ruined it but this is my top three claypus books from jen I'm so excited for this, Jen. Thank you so much. She knows that I've been reading more Lisa Kleypas recently because we've been talking about it. This, I know, is one of her favorites and she raves about it. And I've never seen like this cover before. Or maybe I have and I'm just like mistaken, but I've never seen like this cover before. It's absolutely stunning. And she said not to listen to the audiobook. I know that now because I watched her um, romance takeover vlogs and she talked about how much she hated the audiobook and like how they took out certain things. They planned on the company making the audiobook or whatever, planned on just taking out certain terms that may be offensive to the Romani culture, which I totally understand and is totally valid. But she said that they literally took out scenes and chunks of the book and then made them less steamy and less risque, maybe. Which, I don't know how I feel about that. Um, it's one thing to change the terms, which is totally valid and totally understandable and totally warranted, but to change certain things to make them less steamier in Elisa Kleypas, I don't know how I feel about that. But uh, she said, don't read or listen to the audiobook, so I'm not going to. So thank you so much, Jen. I am so thankful for you. I'm gonna go message you right now and respond to your message. You literally messaged me while I was opening these up so oh, I am so thankful for all of you I love all of my friends I love them so much she recently got my card that I made her and she said she really liked it so <laughs> I made hers an outlander cover so I need to go make even more cards <laughs> I still have like 10 
possibly 10 more to make. Anyway, I'm gonna go eat my egg tacos like normal. We'll see what I have to do for the rest of the day. I'm probably gonna finish again the magic because I am literally obsessed and I need to talk to Jen about it. So we're gonna go do that. <laughs> hey y'all, um, I'm gonna end the vlog here. It's pretty early for when I end vlogs, but um, I have been not feeling great today. Um, we think it might be just because of my chronic illness. I just haven't been feeling good. Um, I had a little dizzy spell inside the other house earlier today, two dizzy spells. I don't want to faint, so <laughs> I'm gonna take a chill pill for the rest of the day. Don't know why I'm feeling faint. Sometimes it's just the way chronic illnesses work. You don't know what's, you don't know what's going on. You don't know why you're having a flare up or a dizzy spell, so it is what it is. <laughs> I've just been working on cards. I'm currently working on, um, I'm actually working on a, you can barely see this because it's washed out, but I'm working on a card that is the cover of my current read, which is still my, uh, Again, The Magic by Lisa Kleypas. Um, I almost said Mine Till Midnight. <laughs> I haven't read that one yet. But I did end up finishing a book today. I ended up finishing Devil's Daughter by Lisa Kleypas, the fifth, fifth book in the Ravenels. I think I'm gonna give this one, I wanna give it a five, but the ending just wasn't enough for me. So I think I might give it a 4.5. The ending was so abrupt. I wanted more with like the couple together and we didn't get that. And so I can't fully love it. It was on the way to a five and then I reached the end and I was like, that's it. That's so sad, I want more. So I'm just gonna be monitoring my heart rate for the rest of the night and working on cards and just taking a chill pill and hopefully going to bed early. Um, I have a few things to do tomorrow. So we're gonna do that. I'm currently watching some booktube while I'm working on cards. So yeah, I also have to edit this video. So we're gonna do that right now. But thank y'all so, so much for watching. Uh, sorry for the lack of content and book content specifically in this vlog. I know I haven't read a lot, um, but you know what? <laughs> I'm doing what I can. <laughs> Anyways, thank y'all so, so much for watching. I will see y'all soon in tomorrow's vlog. Bye, y'all.